my husband, he drives the truck, so he's gone all day long. So it's usually left to me. I'm usually up at uh, 5 or 5.30 a.m. I'm usually doing his 2 p.m. meds and his 9 p.m. meds in the morning. It's probably about 10 syringes of medications, and then he has about maybe six uh, 60 ml syringes of water that I'm prepping and uh, washing for the day. This is, I have my own little hospital room here. Isla, um, you know, she's like, good morning. The, the morning looks like kind of a normal morning, um, except for if she wakes up with like the last few days with the leg pains, we don't know why. For example, so when you have a sick child, then there's this whole other element, you're like, could it be from running around? Did you hurt yourself on the playground? But then with Isla's case, because she's a sick kid, you have to think about, could it be blood pressure? Could it be medicine? Like that's what we're trying to figure out right now. So that's actually right now what's going on. When I send her to school, I have to pack some things in her kit that are like more than packing a lunch and all that stuff. I have to pack like tubes. I have to pack, you know, like extra first aid things. Um, and then a couple medicines. Surgery day was exciting. Uh, me and Takari were pretty ecstatic when we found out that he was going down. He started bouncing off the bed. He he doesn't really get a break um, in a sense that if he's not being poked with a needle, he's um, given meds around the clock running to the bathroom constantly, you know, at some points he's like, why am I going to the bathroom so often? And I'm like, you know, you have a new kidney. So that's what it does. It makes you pee. The last episode he had, I was pregnant and he ended up being intubated. We weren't sure what was gonna happen and talking to his doctors and saying, well, if it gets really bad, we'll see what we can do to get you in. And hearing things like that, when you don't know, um, you just can't be there. It's never, yeah, not having yeah. a choice. So I was so excited. That's all I wanted was to be a mom. Definitely not how I saw my first Mother's Day. And we had no, there was no forward looking to know that we were sorry, guys, one second. I'm sorry. You okay, Papa? You good? Okay, you're good.